Welcome to the Bibles for America podcast. The subject of today's podcast is why it's important to know we can't lose our salvation. Does it make any difference whether we know we can't lose our salvation? The answer is yes, and today we'll talk about why. It will be extremely difficult for us to make progress in our Christian life if we think we can lose our salvation. In fact, our entire Christian life can be undermined. Let's see how this could happen. When we sin, naturally we feel ashamed and regretful. This is a healthy reaction. However, if we don't know and understand the matters of confessing our sins and the effectiveness of Christ's blood to wash us from every sin, our sin will weigh down our conscience. And when we commit other sins, we may think the accumulation of our sins somehow undoes our salvation. The thought that we might not be saved anymore eats away at us, discouraging us further. Every day we question, am I still saved? Instead of pursuing Christ with an unburdened heart, we feel unworthy, making it difficult to pray to Him or read the Bible. We become focused on our behavior, our condition, and ourselves. We begin to lose sight of Christ and His marvelous salvation. In spite of our best efforts, we sin again and begin to despair. And since we're unaware that Christ's blood washes us when we confess our sins, our unconfessed sins start to pile up, weighing down our conscience even more and making us feel our situation is hopeless. Sadly, at this point, some give up on following the Lord because they think their Christian life has suffered irreparable damage and they're already lost. They think to themselves, What's the use? I've already lost my salvation. Why try anymore? So they give up, go back to their old life, and live like everyone else in the world. They didn't know that God's salvation is eternally secure, and they didn't know that the blood of Jesus Christ can wash them of every sin. On the positive side, God wants us not only to be forgiven and to receive Him as our life when we're first saved, he also wants us to go on to know Him, experience Him, enjoy Him, and grow in Him. When we know we're saved and saved eternally, we can go on with a lightened heart to build on that foundation. We can experience progress in our Christian life, and when we sin, we simply confess to the Lord and He cleanses us from our sin. Knowing we can never lose our salvation rescues us from despair and from giving up when we fail. It also frees us to enjoy the riches of God's full salvation spoken of in Romans 5.10. For if we, being enemies, were reconciled to God through the death of His Son, much more we will be saved in His life, having been reconciled. Besides redeeming, justifying, and reconciling us to God, God wants to save us much more in His life. We want to go on to experience this much more salvation. Let's leave the realm of doubt by standing firmly on God's faithful word concerning His eternal salvation. Let's go on into the realm of experiencing and enjoying God's rich, wonderful, and marvelous salvation. Today's podcast was based on Basic Elements of the Christian Life, Volume 1, by Watchman Nee and Witness Lee. You can order a free copy at biblesforamerica.org. You can read the written version of this podcast with links to other helpful posts, verses, and resources online at biblesforamerica.org slash blog. Thanks for joining us. Until next time, grace be with you.